Thanks, Lauren. It's still unclear if there will be sports next school year, but despite that uncertainty, Fresno Unified is still having their students conditioned. CBS 47's Kaylee Hunt spoke with the athletic director for Fresno Unified. Well, practice is looking a lot different for Fresno Unified athletes. Before even walking onto the field, they are screened as well as keeping six feet apart. Now, I'm told this is the new normal until there's a definite answer that there will be athletics or won't be athletics next year. It's just an evolving process. I feel like we're on top of everything we need to be on top of, but there's still things that are changing every single day. Athletes are conditioning daily, despite not knowing if there will be sports for the next school year. Uh, unfortunately, we just don't know. We don't know what the future holds for us. Uh, the hope is and planning that we will have sports in the fall, but we're just not sure. Brett Marr with Fresno Unified says they break up practices by times, which helps these athletes maintain a six foot distance while they run drills. Also making sure that uh, our coaches are wearing their masks and um, you know, just we want to get our kids out conditioning, being active. Back in March, Fresno County schools turned to online learning. So for a lot of these students, this is their only way to get out of the house and have peer interaction. So when a kid does show up every day, I greet them and I check on them. Yeah, I, I, I coach them hard, but at the same time, you got to put a loving arm around them. Head coach Kyle Thornton says with COVID cases rising, they won't know if sports will be back in the fall, and the decision is up to state and county officials. Best case scenario is that we provide kids an opportunity to play a sport they love. And whatever way that looks, we'll adjust to it and do what we got to do. Kaylee Hunt, CBS 47 Eyewitness News.